Yo guys, what's going on? King Flipper here and welcome to another Foot Birthday SBC. Today we are celebrating Foot Birthday 19 with a 5 star skill move con Dogbia. 88 rated centre mid. 80 pace. Mm, would have been nice if it was a little bit better, but the rest of the card looks tank. Uh, 80 pace, 83 shot, 83 passive, 85 dribbling, 88 defence and 93 physicality. High medium work rates, left footed, 5 star skill moves of course with 3 star weave foot, 6 foot 2. Uh, he's, he's got some real good stats, but uh, his pace lets him down. I'm really surprised. I thought he would have been available like, closer to 85 pace, but 80 acceleration, 80 sprint speed, 85 attack positioning, 76 finishing, um, yeah. uh, 99 shot power, 92 long shots, 69 volleys, 50 penalties. Nah. Uh, 87 vision. 72 cross and don't expect anything amazing with free kick accuracy of being 62. 90 short passing and 86 long passing is decent. Curve of 69, a bit naff as well. 81 agility, 8 balance. I thought it might have been a little bit higher, but don't forget he is quite tall. Uh, 92 reactions, 87 ball control, 84 dribbling, 93 composure. Uh, 91 interceptions, uh, 84 head and accuracy, 86 defense awareness, 88 stand tackle, 89 slide tackle. Uh, 82 jumping, 86 stamina, which again, thought it might have been a bit about 90. Uh, 99 strength and 91 aggression. No player trait, really. Uh, it's out for a week. In my opinion, I wouldn't do this at this point in time. I think it's overpriced. It's my opinion. Uh, two SBCs to do. Uh, before we get into it, just to let you know, these are foot bin bite now prices of time in the SBC, which has been out for about 45 minutes to an hour and 15 minutes. Bids and snobs will of course always be cheaper and don't forget prices do fluctuate. So requirements for this one, uh, you need one Valencia player. Uh, I picked in poor Lister as you can see, they've gone up in price. Team of the week players, you need minimal one as you can see, you've got Javic there in that striker position, just the cheapest 81 rated team of the week card at the moment. Uh, team over and of 83, smack bang 83, can't lower anyone else. Team chemistry of 80, run 81 I think. Uh, 86, 85, 84, 83, 82. Yeah, run 81, no position change with loyalty, and 11 players in the squad. As you can see, uh, we've gone Spanish to Liga at the moment. Unfortunately, ev all the players have gone up in price. Uh, 83s and 82s are really a lot more expensive since obviously they brought out another new SBC, which you can get the 83 double upgrade, which I don't know why people are doing because I think it's overpriced. Uh, you can use Yuri as well, but these are the prices that are at the moment. Um, so, Ator is 3.5k. Mm. Uh, Navas is one of the cheapest 84s, that's why I've used him at 10.75. Uh, they've jumped up slowly. Uh, they've gone back up to over 10k, most of them. Uh, Degene is 2.3. Polista is 2.4. Even they're going up. Acuna is 4k now. He was like 3k before this new SBC came out, so you can see they're coming up. Fernando again, 4k. Uh, Porto 4.5, his price has jumped, you'll see when I do the other SBC, Munane is 3.6, another card that's gone up, Coutinho's 4k, Jovic as I said is the cheapest 81 rated team of the week card at the moment, 13k, and Fakir is the other cheapest 83 rated card that I've not, that's not been used, and he is 4.1k, um, yeah, this is coming up 56.15k, but I know prices of players have already started jumping up since I started this SBC, um, so you're looking at probably 60k to push by it now. Uh, bids and snipes, you should be able to get them for about 50. Uh, you get a gold players pack, which is naff. Um, La Liga, requirements for this one though. Uh, you need one La Liga player, as you can see I've actually got five. Uh, team over on of 85, smack 85, can't lower anyone else. Uh, team chemistry of 75, run 75, no position change of loyalty, and 11 players in squad. Um, you can use Pjanic instead of uh, Koke. But Coke is cheaper at the moment. All you got to do then is swap Griezmann and Suarez around, and then you can use Roberto instead of Trippier. But Trippier is cheaper at the moment as well. So we got a mixture of Portuguese players uh, from, our, and then obviously Navas uh, from the Portuguese league, uh, Ligue 1 and Premier League, and then obviously the rest of the players from the Spanish the Liga. So start with Navas. Navas is one of the cheapest eighties in ranked cards, but he's fluctuating around at 39k. Uh, Trippier 5.3k. As I said, 83s have jumped up a lot. Uh, he's still cheaper than Roberto. Uh, Lopez is 3.7. <sighs> he's jumped up 2k in two days. He was like less than 2k, but now he's like 3.7. Uh, Danilo Pereira, 82s have jumped up loads, but he's 1.5. Rafa is 3.8k. Again, another card that's jumped up over a k, k and a half. Uh, Neves is 1.9. Port 2 is 4.9. As I said, he's jumped up from the other SBC, so you can see prices are going up. 
Uh, Koke, as I said, is cheaper than Pjanic at the moment at 18k. Uh, Martinho is 3.9, so again, another card that's 4k. It jumped up over a k since this new SBC come out. Uh, Griezmann's 40k and Suarez is 40k as well. Um, this one's coming up at 162k again. Price of players are going back up, so I'd say about 165 at a push on max buy it now. Prime Electron Players Pack, which is 25k pack, you should be able to get done for about 150 bids and snipes on this SBC. But oh, it's coming up around 220k. You're looking around 220k for this SBC at the point is at this point in time. Is it worth it? No, absolutely not. One. Acceleration, sprint speed, not quick enough now. It needs to be minimum of 85, that's what I said. Uh, I, obviously, he's a box to box player. His passing's decent. 76 flash finishing, eh, it's not too bad. 81 agility, 8 balance. It's too clunky for a, a box to box midfielder. Way too clunky for a box to box midfielder. I, I just, it's kind of crazy. He's got other, other good, he's got good defensive stats. His dribbling stats, other than his agility and balance, are decent. 86 stammer is not good enough anymore for a, a midfielder at this time of the year. It should be 90. Uh, yeah, I, I just this card is uh, I think about 60, 70 k over price. It should be looking about 150 in my opinion. Obviously, player prices have jumped up massively, but I, I just don't know why EA don't ever seem to look at these player prices before they do these SPCs. But that's my opinion. Um, they should really be looking at how. Uh, obviously, if the the 83 double upgrade hadn't been dropped out yesterday, the pro prices, the player prices, this would have been under 200k. Easily should have been about under 200k. I'm getting a bit closer to what I think it would have been worth, but to, nah, nah, it's not worth 220k. Not considering, not considering the, some of the cards we've had that have come out that have been better. I think, in my opinion, I, I just. Let me know in the comments below because I, I don't want to cause arguments. But again, hopefully I'll save you some time and some money. If you are doing it, feel free to drop a thumbs up. It does help the channel and the video. Uh, obviously, if you're new and you want to see more SBC methods or just listen to me waffle, uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you got that notification bell so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these. But other than that, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video stream. Take it easy and obviously, peace.